Gavaskar says Hardik Pandya will be an automatic pick for the T20 World Cup if he bowls. I'll give you more details on that in today's episode. Uske baad, the BCCI is reportedly planning to increase the crowd for IPL 2022 by 65 to 70 percent. Or sabse ant mein, we're going to be taking a look as to how Ravi Shastri has spoken about his price tag if he were to play in the IPL, and he has quoted a premium price tag. What is that all about? I will tell you that in today's episode of News Tracker with me, Navedna Prabhu. Hi, everyone. I hope you're well and of course keeping safe. Welcome to Crick Tracker. Crick Tracker is your one-stop destination for everything related to cricket. Now, before I begin today's video of News Tracker, if you haven't subscribed to our channel as yet, go ahead and hit that button. And without wasting time, let's find out what's making news in the world of cricket. <laughs> The ongoing IPL 2022 is a sort of virtual audition for Indian players to mark a place for themselves in the upcoming T20 World Cup later this year, which is going to be held in Australia. Now, everybody is, of course, going to be looking at which players doing remarkably well in the T20 format, which might help them get a place later this year. On the other hand, Gavaskar has opined about Hardik Pandya and he feels that if Hardik Pandya bowls, then he will be an automatic pick for the upcoming T20 World Cup. Now, what did Gavaskar say? Let's find out. Gavaskar said whether Hardik Pandya will bowl, how many overs he will bowl will also be something which not just the Gujarat Titans but the entire cricketing fraternity will be looking forward to. Because if he starts to bowl and bowl well with his batting ability, make no mistake, he will become an automatic selection for the World T20. Now, how do you all view this? Do you think that is right? Because a lot of conversation about you know, Hardik did happen in the previous uh, T20 World Cup 2021. So, what do you want to Definitely let me know in the comments below. Well, it might be some great news for IPL fans because the BCCI is actually pondering to increase the crowd limit in the ongoing IPL 2022. This is because of the fact that they are of the opinion that, of course, the COVID-19 situation is getting better in India, which is why they would be able to take this uh, decision. So, let me give you more details on that. Now, according to a journalist, K. Srinivas Rao, BCCI might allow close to 65-70% to 70 capacity crowd for the matches. It is also reported that the official announcement will come soon. Even the ticket bookings are not open for all matches at the moment. With the action returning to India and BCCI allowing more crowd, a lot more fans will be able to watch their superstar players from the stadium. Now, what do you all think? Do you think it's a good move or maybe, uh, you know, it's something that could backfire later on because at the end of the day, COVID-19 has not completely vanished. Although the situation is getting better with time. But what do you want to say? BCCI does take this decision. Let me know in the comments. Now, Ravi Shastri is one of the finest all-rounders to have represented India at the highest level. Now, if you think about it, if Ravi Shastri were to go under the hammer for the IPL at this particular era, how much would he go for? Well, Ravi Shastri has revealed the same as to how much money he would make and he scored quite an interesting amount and he said something as well. What did he say? Well, let's find out. Now, Shastri told a leading media house, comfortably in the 15 crore bracket, comfortably and captain of the side, no question, it's a no-brainer. Notably, the salary amount that Shastri has set for himself is more than MS Dhoni's IPL 2022 salary. Now, what do you all think? Do you agree with Shastri's statement? Do you think if he were to play IPL at this particular point, he would go for the amount that Shastri has quoted and also captain of this side? What do you want to say about it? Please share it with me in the comment section below. But with this, friends, this video is over here. If you like the video, you know what to do, right? Give it a big thumbs up. Follow all our social media handles, including our Telegram channel, because over there you'll find some amazing match-winning combos as well as fantasy tips for your fantasy teams. So you wouldn't want to miss out. My name is Nivedna Prabhu. I'll be back very soon with a new episode of News Tracker. But for that, do not forget to hit that subscribe button. And until I see you next time, like I always tell you, take care of yourselves. But most importantly, stay safe. Goodbye.